Sai G, Drum Dave back in the building. Shout outs to my boy Tipsy Bartender. This is where I got the idea from. But today we're gonna do some Jolly Rancher infused shots. Of course, I have to do my disclaimer. Drink responsibly. If you're underage, then you can do this with instead of vodka, just use water. But you know me, I'm way above the drink age. You boys gonna get a little tipsy today. So what you're gonna need is ginger ale, a funnel, a shot glass, obviously, any kind of vodka you can find at the store. We have some Sky Vodka. It's pretty cheap. I think it was like 23 bucks or something. Um, water bottles, empty. If you don't have any, you're gonna have to drink like a bunch of water before you serve. And then the key ingredient, Jolly Ranchers, the hard kind. Look. The hard kind. So we're gonna do four flavors. We got grape, we got blue raspberry, we got cherry, and finally, we got that green apple. Step number one. So you wanna fill your empty water bottle with your vodka. I don't have like one of those easy pour spouts that you put on top, so this funnel thing is gonna make it so we don't make a big mess. All right, just get a bunch of that in. Refilling, refilling. Move it over. This is a lot of alcohol, guys. Drunk Dave. Holy crap! I just used the whole two six. I got about like seven Jolly Ranchers each one, by the way. You can use more if you want, but I think seven for this amount of vodka should be enough. I'm cheese. Then. I don't know how long it's gonna take. 30 minutes, an hour. As you can see, the vodka is already changing the color. It looks really pretty, to be honest. It's been like 10 minutes. Here's a little update. Colors are fusing in nicely, fam. Ooh, oh, the red looks beautiful. The green is a little light. The red and the blue right now, look at that. I can't wait. It's pretty much just the waiting game now, guys. I'll check back in in like 30 minutes. Hey, hello. Here's our final results. Like, obviously, you guys can leave it in for longer. Pour it halfway to the shot glass. I'm not trying to get too turned, fam. And then top it off with some ginger ale, 7-Up, Sprite, anything in that group. Oh, shoot. And as you can see, it's a beautiful purple. I'm cheesed. I should have left it in longer. And here we go. I'm expecting this to be insanely sugary. That tastes exactly like a melted freezy. You know when you're eating a freezy and then the liquid, the melted shit at the bottom? It's like that, the most delicious part, but then you get that like kick from the vodka. Blue is like my favorite freezy color, so. All right, you know what? I'm really cheesed about this ginger ale. It's just messing up my color. So if you're a big mon, then don't even add ginger ale. Just fill up the whole shot with uh, your Jolly Rancher infused vodka. Mm. Gotta be honest, the blue flavor is whack. You don't taste the flavor that much, as much as uh, the grape. To preserve the color, I'm not adding that ginger ale. Oh my God. Look at that beautiful red, you know what I mean? That's a beautiful, look at it. It's nice, huh? <coughs> Ooh. I'm not a, f I'm not a fan of this one. This one's like, meh. Oh, look at that beautiful green. Wow. It looks really green. Drunk Dave, cheers. Yeet? That's disgusting. All right, let me put these away before I get uh, too turned right now. What I would do differently, like if you guys are gonna try this at home, is use the entire pack of Jolly Ranchers. Like I only put about seven or eight in each one and maybe even wait longer because I only waited about 20 minutes for mine because uh, your boy got no patience. Thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you for those thumbs up. You got Drunk Dave in the building. If you guys wanna see more of these drink recipes, then let me know in the comment section below. Road to 500K.
and I will see you guys soon.